Barangay Damayohan, located within the municipality of Magsaysay in the province of Misamis Oriental, Northern Mindanao, Philippines, is a place deep in both cultural and natural history. With its rich heritage, vibrant landscapes, and trails like the Damayohan Trails, it offers unique glimpse into the past and present of this region. Again. Turn it. The short set, the short set. Don't make it fall. Can I make it? Especially when it's up here. Every hiker is working. The history of Barangay Damayohan dates back to the time when the region was inhabited by indigenous groups, primarily the Higaonan people. These early settlers were known for their deep connection to the land, which they revered as both a source of sustenance and spiritual guidance. The Higaonan people practiced sustainable farming, hunting, and fishing, living in harmony with nature. They believed that the forests, rivers, and mountains were sacred and inhabited of spirits, and this belief system shaped their way of life. The name Damayohan itself is believed to have indigenous origins, possibly derived from the local dialect, signifying place of gathering or refuge. Oral traditions passed down through generations speak of the Higaonon's rituals and ceremonies, which were often held in secluded natural sites such as the dense forests and highlands of Damayohan. The arrival of Spanish colonizers in the Philippines in the Lebing Anim Nadihi century brought significant changes to the region, including Damayohan. The Spanish sought to convert the indigenous populations to Christianity, leading to the construction of churches and the establishment of new settlements. Despite resistance, many indigenous people were forced to abandon their ancestral practices and adopt the new religion and way of life imposed by the colonizers. However, Damayohan's remote location provided some insulation from the full impact of Spanish rule. The rugged terrain and dense forests made it difficult for the Spanish to establish complete control over the area. As a result, many indigenous communities in the highlands of Magsaysay, including Damayohan, retained aspects of their traditional culture and beliefs, blending them with the new influences brought by the Spanish. The American occupation of the Philippines in the late Labinsham D.E. and early Dalawampu D.E. centuries introduced new systems of governance, education, and infrastructure development. During this period, Barangay Damayohan began to see gradual changes, such as the introduction of formal schooling and modern agricultural practices. The Americans also built roads and bridges, improving connectivity within Misamis Oriental and facilitating the movement of people and goods. World War I had a profound impact on Damayohan and the surrounding areas. The Japanese occupation brought hardship and fear, as the region became battleground between Japanese forces and Filipino guerrillas. The dense forests and mountainous terrain of Damayohan provided a strategic advantage for guerrilla fighters, who used the area as a base for launching attacks against the occupying forces. The war left scars on the land and its people, but it also fostered a strong sense of resilience and unity among the locals. Let's go for the
After World War died, the Philippines gained independence, and the focus shifted towards rebuilding the nation. In Barangay Damayohan, this period marked the beginning of agricultural expansion, with coconut plantations becoming the dominant form of land use. The fertile soil and favorable climate made Damayohan an ideal location for coconut farming, which quickly became the backbone of the local economy. The establishment of coconut plantations brought new opportunities and challenges. While the industry provided livelihoods for many families, it also led to the clearing of forests and changes in the local ecosystem. However, the people of Damayohan remained deeply connected to their natural environment, continuing to rely on the forests for supplementary food sources, medicinal plants, and other resources. One of the most remarkable features of Barangay Damayohan is the Damayohan Trails, a network of paths that wind through the area's lush forests, coconut plantations, and rugged terrain. These trails have been used for centuries by the local inhabitants for hunting, gathering, and traveling between villages. Today, they have become a popular destination for outdoor enthusiasts, nature lovers, and trail runners. The Damayohan Trails offered quick outdoor adventure, providing a serene escape from the hostel and bustle of modern life. The trails are diverse, ranging from easy walks through coconut grooves to challenging hikes up steep slopes. Along the way, visitors are treated to panoramic views of the surrounding landscapes, including the distant island of Kamigin and its famous volcano, Mount Hibok-Hibok. Mount Hibok-Hibok, located on Kamigin Island, has a storied history of its own. The volcano erupted in isang libo siyam na daan at apat na putwalo, causing widespread devastation and prompting many residents to flee to safer areas, including parts of Magsaysay and Barangay Damayohan. The eruption left lasting impact on the region and the site of the volcano from the Damayohan Trail serves as a reminder of nature's power and the resilience of the communities that live in its shadow.
Kita di mana berdiri ya? Kita di mana berdiri ya? Kita di mana berdiri ya? In the Lawang Libo and the Lawang Putatlo, the Damayuhan Trails gained further recognition as part of the first Sikat Magsaysay Trail Run, major event that attracted trail runners from across the region. Among the participants were Josh and Rose, running couple known for their love of outdoor adventures. The event was a celebration of both the natural beauty of Damayuhan and the spirit of community that has always been a hallmark of the area. The Sikat Magsaysay Trail Run was not just a race, it was an experience that brought together people from different walks of life to enjoy the stunning landscapes of Damayuhan. The trail run highlighted the diversity of the Damayuhan trails, from the challenging uphill climbs to the tranquil paths through coconut plantations. For Josh and Rose, the race was a chance to connect with nature, test their endurance, and explore a new trail that quickly became one of their favorites. Kita akan berdiri lagi. Kita akan berdiri lagi. Kita akan berdiri lagi. Kita akan berdiri lagi. Kita
Not a good thing, everyone. Try to dance this thing. It's a good thing. Try to dance this thing. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Today, Barangay Damayohan continues to thrive as a community that honors its rich history while embracing the future. The Damayuhan trails remain a symbol of the area's natural beauty and the deep connection its people have to the land. Whether for a weekend adventure, a challenging trail run, or simply a peaceful walk in nature, the trails offer something for everyone. The panoramic views from the trails, especially the site of Mount Hibok Hibok and the surrounding sea, remind visitors of the dynamic landscape that has shaped the history of this region. The coconut plantations, forested areas, and highlands all contribute to the unique character of Damayohan, making it a place where the past and present coexist in harmony.
As Barangay Damayohan looks to the future, it does so with a sense of pride in its heritage and a commitment to preserving the natural environment that has sustained its people for generations. The Damayohan Trails will continue to be cherished part of the community, a place where history, culture, and nature come together to create an unforgettable experience for all who visit. Ang mga pituon sa iba 